So, as lots of you know, lots of you don't understand. But as lots of you know, we are on a produce farm. And in the hot summer, you need irrigation. So these are the pumps that pump the water to your irrigation system. That's an old, I don't know what that is. But anyways, we're just looking at some of these pumps. There's one that's pretty weird. So I, I'll say the, I don't know what brand this one is, but we have a Mercedes engine one, a four cylinder Mercedes. We have this old four cylinder and we have a, this one here, which is an 8.1 liter Cummins with a P pump. Then we have a 12 valve with a P pump and we have another 12 valve that's a little strange. Anyways, that's our beast. That will run two irrigation systems with no problem. 8.1 liters. Uh, of course, I got to turn the. I got to start it to uh, check the hours, so I won't do that. But yeah, big P pump, 8.1 liters, powerhouse. And here is a holy grail. This is your 12 valve P pump with a weird intake that I've never seen before. It's a really tall, weird intake. Anyways, mechanical. Mechanical, mechanical. And then we got this one. And I'm sure most of you see what's weird already, that this is a 12 valve motor with this injection pump, which, a little bit of research. This is a VP44 injection pump on a 12 valve. Yeah, didn't know that was a thing because I didn't think the VPs came out until 24 valve days. Now I do know that they kept making 12 valves up until like 2010 for agriculture use or maybe later, I have no idea. I know it was something like that. So maybe they switched from a P pump to this because they thought this was an upgrade, but I guess it hasn't caused us any problems, but it's just weird that a 12 valve is supposed to be a simple mechanical motor and then they slap on a VP, which is the problem child of Cummins injection pumps. So yeah, just thought we'd show you that, it's pretty weird. So that's the end of this video. If any of you guys are into Cummins motors or injection pumps and you notice something that we didn't notice, thanks cool, let us know. If you have any other questions about farm equipment, let us know. There's some, uh, other interesting tractor motors and stuff that we got around. So if you want us to make other cool videos, then uh, yeah, just give us some ideas. Also, it's cold start season, so that'll be starting. What do you want us to cold start first? Old Peterbilt, old Ford tractor, cat bulldozer, let us know. Uh, can we order Cressida? No, has to be diesel. A tractor?